Hey, good afternoon, Pokey folk. It's your boy, Mr. Hands. Atticus is, uh, how would you say, grounded just at the moment. So, wanted to share some things with y'all. We have a bunch of uh, stuff coming in from different sellers off Macari and eBay. So, we're going to be doing some shout outs to them. Uh, the next video you're going to see is a duel. It's going to be Atticus against his friend Don. And they're going to duel for just for fun. So, as you see in front of us, I like to make little things for my coins. Uh, notice there's really no um, stuff out there for, you know, the coin collecting. You can only use like the little white cardboard ones that you usually use for regular coins or the see-through plastic, yada, yada, yada. Well, I like to get a little creative, so tell me uh, if y'all like what y'all see. But let's go ahead and uh, just open a few little things. Uh, let's see. Stopped at a Dollar Tree and uh, picked up some fun. Get the doctor's tool. Let's go ahead and start with some Lost Thunder and his boy Lightning. Alrighty. Let's see what we have here. Alright, alright. If we can get it in there. There we go. You get a little bit in there. There we go. Look at that beautiful Lugia pack art. <laughs> Look at that. Ladies and gentlemen, very first pack. Can we say a new king of the dollar store? Check that beautiful Mimikyu. The centering on it is almost immaculate on the front. The corners are nice. Oh, look at that. No whiting. It's a little more up to the top than the bottom. Let's go ahead and put that baby in a sleeve. Because I can't believe Mimikyu on first pull. Let's see what else we got. So, what's y'all's favorite uh, set from Sun and Moon? Mine, personally, is Cosmic Eclipse. Just chasing those secret rares, you know. It's mm, the art is beautiful. Pokemon with their trainer. I actually, uh, in our collection, we have a complete set, but it's in Chinese. I personally like the Chinese art. Because it's essentially the same, different border, but the back is the same as the English cards versus, you know, like the Japanese one. It'll be uh, the Japanese back, but anyways, what's y'all's favorite set from Sun and Moon? We got an Eevee. Ooh, look at that. Rimbom Rimbombi and a Trumbeak. Look at that. It's two hollows back to back. We will not argue and we will not complain with the Pokey Gods. What is this one? Oh, we got a Sun and Moon. I've got Grubbin, Mascarini, and an Electric Energy. Thank you. Thank you. Put that there. Empty sleeve for the next one. I have a feeling. We got another sun and moon right here. And Stuffle. Togedemaru. And a leaf energy. Alrighty, let's see what else we got. Believe it or not, it is another sun and moon. Alrighty, I like the base set. I like trying to get the Espeon or the uh, Umbreon. That is our main goal today. So, Schnurball! Lantern, 
nice rare. And Poliwhirl, looking almost faded with a turquoise. I like Poliwhirl, and Poliwag, Polyrath, and Politoed. I almost forgot it. Ooh, that one opened up pretty nicely. I like that art. Let's see. I like to try to guess. It's going to be two commons and an uncommon. <laughs> Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. Two commons and an uncommon. So, if y'all didn't know, the dollar store packs, the three packs, they come in different kind of, uh, how would you say, sequences. You either get a common, uncommon, and rare, or you get a common, common, uncommon. Yep, and there goes a bunch of code cards in my lap. Just trying to balance this camera. Got Makuita. Cutie Fly, and one of my favorites, Dragonair. Looking back at it. Looking back at it. Gotta love Dragonair. Oh, if y'all remember fighting Elite Four. Yeah. <laughs> that boy and his dragons. Alright, what do we got here? We got Cosmog. Rallet. And Timer Ball. Let's see if we can keep it going, keep it going. Morellum. Chincho. And a fire energy that's completely off center. Check that out. Someone's been rushing. Rushing really. Oh my gosh, check the corner. That is significant. Look at the angle that is. I'm going to put that on a sleeve just because I like crimps. And I also like corner errors, back errors, certain uh, cosmetics that make them, you know, unique. So we got a pharaoh. Look at that art. It looks almost like he's doing ribbons like in the Olympics. If you can, two can too. And grand ball. Looks like our boy done grown up. Schnubble done grown up. We got another sun and moon here. All right, pick a pick. Carvana, na na na. Thank you, Lionheart. Lionheart, you are one of my favorite uh, influencers to watch, and I cannot help but get down with the sickness and a wishy-washy. You know, I wish she wasn't so wishy-washy. Be a little bit more consistent. Wishy-washy, that is not Lionheart. He's always consistent. So we got Crab Brawler. Crab Brawler. And drowsy. And one more time. Looks like we got Rick Ross in the house. Look at him. Look at him. He's just so determined. Nothing can stop him. So, what's the rumor with the, uh, the No More Fairy energies? Or is that No More Fairy Pokemon? Or I'm guessing they go hand in hand. Uh, if you could, throw it in the comments. I'd like to know. Uh, me and my boy are always trying to figure out what the uh, word on the street is. So we got Togedemaru again. We got a Grimer. And a beautiful rainbow energy. Not hollow, but still beautiful. And got another Sun and Moon. I see a Guardians Rising next. So we got Diglett, also known as Floor, exclamation mark. Ooh, look at that, Bound Sweet, Reverse Hollow, and a Steeny. All right, let's go ahead and put a sleeve on it. If you like it, then go put a sleeve on it. All right. Guardian, Sun and Moon, Rising. All right, chop, 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 chop. Ooh, and a hollow, reverse hollow, but still beautiful. It is a rare. 
Talon Flame. Alrighty. Here in the Bowman House, we always sleeve our hollows. Always. We got another Guardian Rising. We got a Murkrow. Probopass. That's the rare. And Aether Paradise Conservation. What is that? Arena? Area. Awesome possum. Come on, go. get down with the sickness. All right. So, I think my first question to y'all was, what is y'all's favorite Sun and Moon set? Now, what is your favorite special set that came in between? You know, like Hidden Fates. Are you more of a... Ha! Huh. I knew it. I knew it. I felt it. I just felt it. Another reverse hollow. Is it killing my soul? No, because it is a rare, ladies and gentlemen. See? Beautiful, nice little star down there. It's a star, baby. It's a star. You're going to go far, kid. You're going to go real far. Ooh, we got another Guardian Rising. Oh, got a Lowland Sand True right off the muscle. Orcurio! An Altar of the Moon. Na, 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 na. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Cast form. Fletchender. Fletchender. How you doing, sir? Looking fetch, sir. All righty. Next one. Guardians Rising. We got Nose Pass. Solid it. We got another cast form and a Turtonator. Look at that beautiful rare. It's not hollow, but hey, we'll take it. I'll take it. Yeah, I'll take it. Look at that. Wishy-washy. Always so inconsistent. Oricorio doing the hula. And watchdog. Watchdog. We got Deli Bird. Because the bird is the word. And look at that beautiful reverse hollow Mimikyu. Why is he always so dark? Like, his satire is just so morbid or something. I don't know. Look at that smile. What is he smiling about in a dark room? A dark cave? Is that a teddy bear with its head cut off? Jesus. Save that teddy bear. Gosh, I hope that's not a real Pokemon. And we got a dual pack of Thunder and Lightning. Thunder. See the thunder. Lightning and the thunder. When I had to kiss his favorite songs. Patience. Patience. Use the force. Alright. Come on. We got it right there. There we go. We'll flip it around and drag it backwards. All right, we got Slowpoke. Look at Slowpoke, man. He tripping on. S what is he holding? Is he sniffing his tail? Oh my goodness. Brookish. Look how vicious he looks. Oh my goodness. Is that a dark energy? Very nice. All right. Let's see here. Let's see here. Hear ye, hear ye. Come one, come all to the Thunder. Lost Thunder Brigade. Where are my Thunder Brothers at? And my Thunder Sisters. You know what I mean? Come on. Here we go. Here we go now, do -si do You know what? Let's just go ahead and drag it up the top. Here we go. Water energy. Let Leo. Let Leo. 
and Miltank. What is Miltank doing? Is he... Is he surfing? I don't know. It's hard to tell. You think Miltank hits a uh, Aspen one time? You know? Get some s slopes in. There we go. First time's a charm. Come on, let's get something. Let's get a GX. Let's get a Lugia. Ladies and gentlemen. Nenkara. Don't you wanna? Don't you wanna? Nenkara. Blitzel. He's the schnitzel. His name is Blitzel. His life is a riddle. When he falls asleep, his mouth does dribble. Alright, there we go. Alright, alright. Put that there. Flip that up. And we got Heracross. Larvitar. Menarmenar. And when you get stuck and it's dark out, you can always count on Lickwick to slick quick. Last name Rick. He is definitely first pick. All right, last pack. Last packs. You know, I got these from the dollar store from the back. I got the whole box, all 60 of them. And I know they haven't been tampered because they're all still sealed. But sometimes you just, you just think, you know, I guess that's a little paranoia on it. So we got Fairy Charm. Jigglypuff, Jigglypuff. And Mo Reap. Mo Reap, 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 Reap. You reap what you sow. All right. Come on. Last but not least. You got this. Let's end with a Lugia. All right. Marini. Why are you being so sneaky? Bruxish and adventure bag. It's perfectly fine, ladies and gentlemen, because we ended on a hollow. That's to keep our good luck going to next time. Uh, the next video, like I said, will be a duel between Atticus and his friend. It'll be a quick one. And then uh, there's a little surprise in that one as well. But the next main video, we're going to open up a Shining Fates Elite Trainer Box. And since we always share one piece of our collection with y'all at the end of every episode, I guess we'll open up the McDonald's 2020 one promotion. Look at all these shadows. Alrighty. Literally. When I say we were buying Happy Meals and passing them to every kid at the hotel that we were at, we bought over 40 something Happy Meals and in doing so, we're able to, you know, make sure that kids got food. They also got Pokemon cards. And the McDonald's was nice enough to sell us one extra for each Happy Meal that we got. So we got two per Happy Meal, practically. So that way... Yeah, let's get a nice little... Bring the brightness down. Hit the focus. Isn't it beautiful? It's almost perfect. We got Pika Pika Pikachu for days. Look at that. Oh, the Bulbasaur. 
Boba sword. Boba, Boba. Good. Got them all. Cause we got them all. Or nothing at all. There's nowhere left to crawl. Once you catch them all, it's all or nothing. Alrighty. So, as you see, this baby goes on for a long, long time. But I will show y'all a little... You know, I just got back into Pokemon this year, uh, year about a year and a half ago. So, the only other McDonald's promos I have where you at? Oh, here we go. Pidov. Do you see him? He's from 2011. And then I have Oshawa from 2011 as well. Yeah, nice. But other than that, ladies and gentlemen, I do bid you a farewell. And remember our core values. Never, ever give up. Stay out of trouble. And Mr. Hands, Mr. Hands is really serious about this. Always finish the job. Never give up. Or is it my boy from, uh, uh, what's that movie, uh, the one with the space, where they're like Star Trek almost, but they're not, and it has Tim from, uh, or it has, uh, oh, what is it? You are our last hope. You know, never give up. Never surrender. Ladies and gentlemen, until next time, keep it cool.